from Zabel Stadium on the campus of the College of William and Mary in historic Williamsburg, Virginia. The Lafayette Sports Network in cooperation with RCN Television, WBPH Channel 60, ESPN Game Plan, ESPN 3, and the Masson Sports Network presents Lafayette College football. It's the 2012 opener, and the Leopards will take on the tribe of William and Mary. It is unbelievable what has happened in the last minute. Back over the middle, that's going to be intercepted. The ball is caught by Jared Roberts. Jared Roberts, the 6'2", 190-pound sophomore out of Penn, Sauk, and New Jersey, comes up with the interception. Well, we'll get a look at it. Grant was just trying to go down the middle of the field. Keep an eye right here on his tight end. He's going to see the tight end with an arc release. The tight end goes down the middle. Did a great job right there getting a piece of him going down the middle, which took the tight end off his route. Jared Roberts playing the back. Ron, the deep back. He will follow and get a first down. That's a good. Well, he's got to get it again. He stays on his feet. Hebron trying to get in the end zone. That is a Lafayette touchdown. 14-yard run for Vaughn. Hebron, the first touchdown at 2012. What a run. Yeah, what a great run. The offensive line got a little stacked up on the inside right there, but Vaughn Hebron stayed patient just like he did on the other one. And you're going to see him right here run into a little bit of a wall. You're going to get down, down right here, a pinch by the DN. Mazer does a good job just driving downhill. And then what a great effort right here. He's going to carry B.W. Webb, their best defensive player, into the end zone. Sherman back in, back to throw is Shoup. Looking, Shoup looking, firing, he's got a man. And he will drop it into the belly. That's a good catch by Brandon Hall. But you have to get a first down since so coming back after the delay. Here they'll kick it out. And this is going to be a nice play. Catching the football and running with it is Mike Duncan, the wide receiver, sophomore out of Missoula. Three-man front employed by the Tribe. This time they go over the middle. Second catch of the game for Brandon Hall. And Brandon Hall is a load to bring down. Back, going down. Graham couldn't find anybody. That's a coverage sack. As there was a white jersey on every green jersey. And that allowed Shane Dorner to come in and make the tackle. They're going to give it to Sabor. Sabor will run through a couple of tacklers. But is there a fumble? It looked like there's a fumble on the play. Lafayette says they have it. Back to throw. Firing wide open, oh my! Wide open is Mark Ross, he does it down and out, and there wasn't anybody there. Half the yardage will set up a little easier field goal. Back over the middle, that's gonna be a touchdown! Lafayette, oh my! Mike Duncan with the grab, the sophomore with his first career touchdown. Weather playing in their first ball game. Mike just picked up ice cream for himself. Oh, big hit, fumble! The ball is still loose and falling on it for William and Mary is pick number 56. Look, check that. Forcing the sack, James Kasha got over the football. 6'4, 300 pound junior. This time it's Hebron. Again, he kicks it to the outside. That should have been a loss. In the backfield, Shoop is back. Looking, looking. Fires over the middle. Nice catch, nice move. That's a move by a big guy, Greg Kessel, 6'1", 240. That's a good catch. Make it, Shoup, Shoup, Shoup has a first down. Five of them in his career. It's up in the air, Lafayette has it. Lafayette comes up with it, that's Mark Ross hugging the player that came up with the football and it's Sherman, Ross Sherman with it. But that's all she wrote, wow. The Lafayette Leopards with a 17-14.